This video is designed specifically for women who are just getting started in photography or who want to pick up a few extra tips on posing before their next photo session. Here are five quick tips for women to be ready before their next photo session. This is part two in our posing series where women will learn the basic techniques of posing during a live photo session. And as a bonus, at the end of this video, I'm going to go over one of my personal techniques on how to look thinner in every photo you take. All right, tip number one, it's super S curves. For women, we want to show off your curves. So you want to have a pop in the hip, you want to have a pop in the shoulder, that will make every picture look so much better. All right, tip number two, you got to keep your arms off your body. And what I mean by that is when your body is adding extra dimension because your arms are on top of you, if your arm is physically next to you, you're making yourself look bigger. And we don't want that. We want you to look as thin as possible. So keep your arms off your body. Give yourself some angles, some space in between your body and your arm. All right, so what that does is it immediately makes you look thinner because your arms are separated from your body and now we're just taking a, a photo of the core of your body, which is taking up a lot less space. Tip number three has a lot to do with the tip number two, but that is triple triangles. We want to have the triangles on your body to have at least three positions. All right, so triple triangles. First one's going to be on your elbow, so you want to form a actual triangle against your body. The second one's going to be where your knee is. So you want to elevate your knee up and give yourself a triangle down by your legs. And then the last triple triangle of the triple triangles is either going to be your neck or your wrists. And I'll show you that in the next video. Tip number four, you're going to be smaller sideways. And that's that little, almost like that little trick I did with the neck, but smaller sideways. When you're posing in front of the camera, I want you to be more sideways. Unlike men, where you want bigger is better. Women, we want to look smaller sideways. Also, when you're going sideways, you're going to naturally be forming more of an S curve. What I mean by that is we want you to be having less space taken up. So you're going to do that by going sideways. Right, tip number five is lift your leg. And I have a pretty funny example coming up, but lifting your leg doesn't mean you need to do an aerial split or doesn't mean that you need to lift it up behind your head. What that means is just lift up your leg, one of your legs, so that you form this natural arch. Even if you have tennis shoes on, I want to have your, you want to have your legs, at least one of your legs to have an arch. And that's going to be part of that triple triangle as well. When you do that, it gives you a nice beautiful curve down on your legs and enhances every picture. Okay, so the bonus is going to be the jawline. Is a, it, This is my personal little tip that I give to my clients. Um, and what that is, is we want to separate that neck from your chin. We want it from your neck and your chin and forming more of a distinct jawline. Let me take a look at this. So this is more of a turkey neck. Go out like that. That's going to separate your neck and make your neck area look thinner. So even if you're laughing, ha ha ha, and that naturally comes. But we want to separate out, out that neck and naturally it feels weird. You look beautiful.